Hello everyone and welcome to the video. I'm Simon and I'm here with Brett Hello. and today we're going to be taking a look at four cars I've just bought from a charity shop. Now this charity shop is actually quite expensive, it's really overpriced on a lot of things and what they've been doing is they get four die cast models sometimes they're like really cheap ones like worth 10 pence or whatever and they put them in a bag of four and they charge you two pounds for them and I only go in there just on the off chance to see if I can find anything and this time I did now these four cars work out as 50 pence each and I'm going to tell you the well I'm going to show you the two that are okay but I wasn't that interested in and then you're going to see the two ones that I really like and one of them I think is worth more than the 50 pence that I paid so first up we've got this Mercedes made by Matchbox and something I really do like about these old Matchbox and old, some old um, Hot Wheels is the fact that the doors open on them which you have to pay extra for now how can how much of a scam is that? Um. Well, the thing is, they, it costs more to design it and stuff like that now. So it's just gonna, it's a, it's a nuisance. It's just a way of life. Like it was only like less than ten years ago when you were still getting some Hot Wheels cars with opening bonnets. Like we were getting um, Dodge Chargers, '69 Dodge Chargers with opening bonnets, and now they're solid. There's nothing opening at all. So it's just a thing of the times. It's a shame, but there's not a lot you can do about it. But this car I actually had when I was a kid. I had one of these, so I didn't really want this. In the policey? Yeah, same same livery and everything. So I think he's a good car. He's in, he's a bit play worn, but he's quite good. And he, a bit hairy. Hey. Eh? There's hair on it. Uh. Next up is a Lightning McQueen that's been through a bit of mud. <laughs> Only a pit of mud. A pit of mud? <laughs> There's people out there like Lightning McQueen. My it's got kid, a few chips. My son does. It's not a bad little car. A few more chips. It's a shame it's a bit too wide to put down our racetracks, but. How on earth did right. you tell? Well, it's, it's, uh, it's slightly wider than that car. And that car will fit down the racetrack. That car definitely won't. Right, now let's get to the ones that I do like. First up, it's nothing majorly special. It's just that I like this uh, this casting of the Porsche 959. And he's got a bit of play wear on it again. But he's a nice looking model, I like this one. What's the best bit about it? I just like the shape of it. Like It's not my favourite casting by Matchbox of a Porsche. The, mine, the 911 is my favourite, I think. If you get that in silver, that, that looks really nice. Why specifically silver? Um, when I was a kid, Skeletrix had Porsche 911 sets, mm -hmm. and there was two cars in there. There was a, a gold one and a silver one, and they always looked stunning. And every time I, I've got the silver one, oh, um, I do have the silver one, but it's not where it was. <laughs> Like that, I have to sell one. Oh. It's, well, it, it's been on that <laughs> shelf for years, and now it's not there. <laughs> Somebody's moved it. But that's I'm the one I like the best. Yourself. Um, <laughs> in my opinion. But now, this is the one I really like. Now, the reason I really like this one Wait. is because I've got this model in some other things. But when I was a kid, I had this, and it got broken. And here it is, a Roller Max police car. Now I've got a rescue car, and one that's in brown. And in a bucket full of die casts we had recently, there was headlights. one of these that was broken. But this one has the uh, the turning blue light on it. And I love the roller mags. So they're a really good idea. Now what we're going to do is when he's finished turning it around. Like he said. What? Where's the lights? What? What do you mean? The headlights are on the front, but this is the they light. They're headlights. Turns. Yeah, there is. These little black bits here. They're dots. You burk. Now what you do is... As you're rolling it round, there's a little lug on the wheels, just there, that every time it goes past a certain point, it knocks the mechanism inside the car that makes the light move. So it's supposed to look like the light's going round. I suppose the faster you go, the better it would be. Yeah. I love these. You had roller matics come in all six sorts of uh, models, which we will be showing on this channel eventually yeah we'll do it 
I love these things. I used to love these when I was a kid. But my one, it, the sticker was missing because my brother had it first. Mm -hmm. So the sticker was missing, the light wouldn't turn, and one of the wheels was busted. <laughs> like bent upwards, so it didn't drive properly. So I think to get that for 50 pence, I was quite happy with that. So let me now, know. Now, which one of this lot's your least favourite? Least? Hmm. Um, I don't know, because I like Lightning McQueen. If you had to produce an order. I think it's not my least favourite because of anything bad about it, but because I already had it. It's this one, because I've already got it. But if you had to put them in an order? Well, then it'd be least, most favourite. Why? He said this is most favourite. Yeah, this because, one. Well, and you said these two are the ones you didn't care. I do much have the nine five nine already, but I just like the the casting of it, and I'm gonna keep it and use it. This one I like because I like like the McQueen, but I expect your brother will take it. And this one's just is the only reason it's my least favourite is because I've already got it. I've always I like them all really, but I have already got that one. And I know I've already got this one, but I like the casting. All right, what's your favourite then? Hmm. It's going to take all day for you to think now, isn't it? Not really. Well, go on then, what's your favourite? Hmm. In a way... Go on then, in what way? I suppose that one is alright because it does something different. Yeah. Then I'd probably go. I'll dare you ask a question. Oh, I didn't have an answer <laughs> before. <laughs> you should be able to just like know what you like straight away. Yeah, but I have this free. So what? Which is your favourite then? Then it might go maybe this one. The police one? Maybe. Alright. Then I'll probably go along with Queen and then that one I don't really care too much about. Okay, there you go then. You answered. And this one was your favourite. Because it does something. That's the whole point of them. Roller Matics, they do something. I like that. Anyway, if you want to see some more vintage die cast or even some modern die cast, then please subscribe to the channel. On this channel, we're going to be looking at all different types of uh, die cast models, big and small. Eventually. Well, it's going to take time, but we'll get there. And then we'll show you all different types of things from really cool models to models that do stuff, models that don't, and models that are, have a meaning for me. So if you like this, please subscribe to the channel. It's 100% free to do. And until next time, we'll see you again. Bye-bye. Thanks.